Hey, Dave here from Adaptroman. I was going to cover some of the benefits and features of our Dabberry Egg Quartz Dab Nail. So what is a Dabberry Egg? It's a type of quartz dab nail. And what is a quartz dab nail? Well, a quartz dab nail is a type of accessory used for vaporizing essential oils, or what many call dabbing. Isn't that a dance or something? Well, yes, it is a type of dance. That isn't the type of dabbing that we're talking about today. The dabbing we're talking about involves vaporizing your concentrated or essential oils that are extracted from various herbs and plants. Great. So now I need to buy a new dab rigger water pipe now, right? No, not at all. They're compatible with your favorite glass apparatus already. You just need to simply attach it to your glass pipe. Okay, but didn't my dab rigger already come with a nail? Yes. There's a high chance it did, but chances are the dab nail was made from glass. Yeah, it did. And I got myself an upgraded nail already. Understandable. If you upgraded to a titanium nail, I can understand why you would want the durability. But you happen to get some of the best flavors from quartz nails. Actually, I do have a quartz nail on my glass apparatus. Why would I need another one? Well, let's talk about some of the design errors found in the other dab nails. Other dab nails require you to choose the correct angle. Some quartz dab nails have a shallow dish head. Most dab nails have an open dish. And then some of the dab nails have a post that are actually too close to the internal dish wall. A lot of the dab nails actually allow the oils to be sucked into the glass pipe because the stem might be too close to the dish bottom. A lot of times the open dish head allows your oils to spatter out easily onto your tabletop or onto your carb cap. Flat bottoms will actually allow cool spots to happen on the dish walls, and your dabs will actually try to run up the walls away from the hot, not vaporizing properly. When you have the wrong angle for your dab nail, your dabs can actually spill off the dish head, wasting a lot. Shallow dish heads will let your dabs overflow and also get wasted. When your dish has an open nail head design, it kind of just lets the temperature out into the air so it doesn't hold it very well. It can actually become difficult cleaning a dab nail when the post is too close to the dab wall. So if you have heavy buildup, it's going to start affecting your flavors and how well it's vaporizing your oils later. When you can actually suck the oils into your pipe, it lets reclaim buildup, wasting your dabs, making your pipe dirty, and ruining the flavor of other hits that you take later. Oils that spatter out of the dish don't get vaporized. They either get stuck to the carb cap or stuck to your tabletop, so you don't even use it. Your oils will naturally want to run to the cool spots on the quartz, not letting them vaporize properly. Okay, and how does the Dabberry Egg solve these problems? Well, let's go over how our Dabberry Egg has improved on some of these design issues. Notice the egg-shaped dabbing dish. This shape was chosen for several reasons, all of which are beneficial to dabbing. Due to the egg-shaped head, it's compatible at a 45 or a 90 degree angle for dab rigs or water pipes. The extra deep dish prevents any type of overflow or spillage. The egg shape actually holds the internal heat in the nail head, and it's super easy to clean with a Q-tip because there's no corners for buildup. This egg shape actually helps prevent any oil being sucked into the pipe, so you get less reclaim, prevents your oils from spattering out of the dish with a smaller opening, and this shape forces all your dabs to consistently stay at the bottom of the nail. Getting a nail like this gives you versatility for which glass pipe you want to use it with. You never have to worry about taking a dab that's too large or if it's spilling over the side of the dish wall. With the enclosed nail head from the egg shape, the heat stays trapped, giving you better flavors and a longer lasting dab while using less of your oils. With no corners, you can always have a clean head for each dab you take. With less reclaim buildup, that means less waste to dabs and a cleaner, better tasting pipe that you don't have to clean as often. With dabs not spattering out of the egg, you have less dabs flying onto your table or getting onto your carb cap, wasting less of it, so you're getting more every time you take a dab. Because of the egg shape, all of your oils are forced to a single point, allowing them to vaporize properly and not get into a cool spot on your quartz. Okay, all of that sounds really cool, but how do I use the Dabberry Egg? Well, let me show you how it works. It's quite simple, really. You need a blowtorch, you need a dab rig, and of course, you need the Dabberry Egg. Oh, and silly me, you need a carb cap too. So you'll go ahead and you'll put your Dabberry Egg onto your dab rig. You'll want to go ahead and heat the bottom of the Dabberry Egg for about 30 seconds. Now, after you've heated it for 30 seconds, you'll want to get your dab ready because you have about a 30 to 45 second waiting period for it to cool off. So once you get your dab ready, you can go ahead and stick it in and you'll want to go ahead and stick the carb cap on. Now, again, like I said, you want to wait about 35 to 45 seconds before you dab it after heating it. Now, once you stick the carb cap on, what this does is as you can see, it makes a seal 
only allowing air to come into this one little hole, letting the vapor become nice and thick and letting the heat really stay trapped in the quartz nail, letting you take a nice long, low temperature dab. We actually have a live demonstration of how to use the dab berry egg on our product page, so if you want to go ahead and check it out, we have a link below this video. Hopefully you have a better idea as to how to use our quartz dab berry egg to get better flavors, thicker hits, and more from each dab while using less of your oils. If you still have any questions, please feel free to click the live chat icon, send an email, or give us a call. We will gladly help answer any questions you may still have. Thank you for watching this video and visiting our website.